So this is code.org, CS Discoveries. Um, I'm working on unit two, which is the HTML unit. I'm on lesson eight, clean code and debugging, level five. Let's see what we're gonna be doing here. Ooh, formatting. Formatting is critical for the readability of code. The way that you write code can make it easier and harder to find bugs. If you use white space and indention, it will make it easier to read and easier to fix. Do this, look at the code with your partner, hi partner, and discuss how you should format the code to make it easier to read. Make the code easier to read by adding new lines and indention, and indin, indin, indentation. Fix all the bugs so that your page matches the target page below, okay? So, hmm, that looks all right. That, I think, is fine. It's just that theirs is a bit bigger, but that's still uh, looking all right. Well, oh, we're missing a picture here. What picture is that? Go-karts, go-karts. So there's nothing even added there. Let's go ahead and format this, though. So how you want to format it is I, you want to find the, each tag and just hit enter because it will automatically indent and show us, I'm going to go ahead and shrink this down. It will automatically indent and show us where everything is located. Well, that's the end of a tag, but there's not a new tag. I'm still going to hit enter just to separate it out. Um, there's a new tag. Here's a new tag. Here's a new tag. Uh, that's the close of the tag. Here's a new tag. Uh, ooh, here's a new tag and it looks like they didn't close the last one. So you can see how formatting like this is really, 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 really worth it. It just makes it easier to see things. Oh, I did the last of the tag and not the start of it. Let's try that one again. Okay, and an image tag, sounds good to me. And this looks kind of funny because it's so long, but that's how it is. And you can see all this pink. So what errors do we have? Well, now that we can see the code a bit better, let's go ahead and start at the top. Uh, picture, okay, our go-kart tag. Well, I don't see anything that says for Richard go-karts. Picture gallery, oh, wood tag. So wood car must be first, yes. All right, wood car, L-I. That's our first thing, picture gallery. Oh, yep, here we are, SRC. Now why wouldn't this work? What are we missing here? Hmm, it is, what do we need? We need quotes on every image tag. It might even, let's go back, does it show us? Uh, that just tells us how to format and then, oh, all right, it just wants us to know. Well, good thing we do. We need a quote around this. If it doesn't pop up, oh, and I just, I like having these ending things. If it doesn't pop up, hit refresh and save and see if it does. There we are. That looks much better already. Um, something else I noticed, this doesn't have a paragraph tag up here. Let's go ahead and do that just for formatting sake. Okay, let's make sure it doesn't change anything huge. Nope, that looks good. Okay, and then, well, what's going on? Is this all supposed to be, so I see the start of our list. I don't see the end of it, and there's a lot of pink. Let's try fixing that. Boom, UL. Well, that looks right now, but notice we need the UL wrapped around the entire list, but each list item, each thing you want to bullet point really needs an opening and closing tag. So let's close that guy off and let's close that guy off. You might say, well, but there weren't major problems right there. It was functioning, but as sites get more complicated, it definitely won't with small bugs, even like that. All right, so that looks good. We got that image working. So let's see, that is fine. Yep, okay. And then, oop, here's a new tag. Let's hit enter, let's miss that. Why isn't, oh, well, I know why this one isn't working. There's nothing here. So let me start typing O, C, what's the name of it? Oh, O, S, Oscar, O, S. Oh, and it pops up, so I'm just gonna hit enter because I know it will be exactly spelled perfect then. Yep, and there it is, great. And then Alt, what's going on with Alt? 
Ah, you always need quotes. And I'm still going to use the slash to close it. And also, I'm going to put this down a line. Let's refresh and see what we're working with now. Wow, that is a start. So let's keep it going. Did that pop for us? Yes, yes, we're doing well. OK, what do we got next? From Scotty, that looks fine. Let's move this down a line. SRC equals will that image is working. Alt looks OK. And again, I'm going to add the ending thing for that. Uh, let's move this down. Formatting makes life easier. It really does. That looks fine. Let's move that guy down. Grass cars. That sh oh. Well, SRC is the file correct? Yeah. Aha. Did you see it? Equals. Hopefully that. And then I'm going to add our ending tag. Let's make sure this is on a separate line just to make it look pretty. Oh, something's wrong though. I see pink in our code. Oh, it must already be on a second line. Okay. All right. So let's do, oh, not finish, refresh and save, see if that's working for us. Ooh, wow, that is a car. Uh, what's this pink stuff? What is that? Wait, did they end the list way down? Yeah, no. All right, let's get rid of this stuff. It looks like they wanted, or I'm not sure if they were, what were they doing? How's the airs look? Yeah, none of this stuff is supposed to be on the list, right? It's all the way over here. There's no bullet points. So we're just going to get rid of this garbage. It should have been way up here somewhere. And even then, it was wrong. So that looks good. Oh, now we have no pink. How's the page looking? Well, it looks, yeah, it's looking just like theirs. So that is a mission accomplished. I'm going to go ahead and hit finish and move right on to the next lesson.